Hi everyone, thanks for joining us. In the last video, I told you we'd have guests today. And so joining me are Lynette Kronelka and Jim Machorek, who are the chairs for our strategic planning process. And so we're delighted to have them with us today. Lynette, to you first, what has impressed you the most about our campus coming together for our strategic planning process? It's really the sheer numbers of those that want to get involved in this process, from staff to students to faculty to alumni to community members. The numbers are wonderfully staggering. And so we're trying to find ways where we can get everybody's voices heard and the excitement just continues to grow. Wonderful. And Jim, what are the next steps in the process as we go forward? Well, <laughs> we have seven groups that have been identified, as we told everyone in the, in the various uh, uh, updates to campus. But now those are almost completely populated. The co-captains that the SPC approached have been incredibly energetic in reaching out to everyone. And the responses have been tremendous. In fact, we've had so many people volunteering, self-nominating, that we're actually, we we couldn't have everyone on, on each individual work group. There's too many folks who are interested. So we're actually going to have those folks, in some cases, serve as part of a focus group, or in other cases, be sort of an advisory body to the particular work groups. So we're really, really excited about it. But that's the work of the, of the work groups. Now, the SPC, as all the work groups are looking at the individual themes that they've, they've been asked to examine, uh, the SBC itself, sorry, the Strategic Planning Committee itself, is going to be looking at the mission, values, vision of UND, because we're going to have to try to harmonize all these things that we're learning, directions we want to be going, bring these all together. And so as well as serving as members, liaison members on the work groups, every SBC member is going to be serving on one or more of the work groups as a liaison. Um, so they'll be busy people, but we're also going to be doing all this really fascinating work making sure that, the, that the, the mission, the values, the vision of UND are on track for the future. Nice. And I love the word that you chose, harmony, right? Bringing everything into harmony. And the amount of work that's happening is truly extraordinary. And Lynette, I know there's members of the campus community who are still itching to get involved. What are ways that they can still uh, stay involved in this process? Absolutely. So we do have an open house coming up on Wednesday, May 4th, from 9 to 10 AM in the morning at the Student Union, the Memorial Union. And if, if someone can't attend that, we also will have, uh, there, there's a share feedback button on our strategic planning website. So individuals can leave feedback there. Um, we have some focus groups coming up in, in the spring that are gonna be scheduled soon. And those will carry through throughout the summer. So we're continually getting, gathering feedback from individuals from various groups. And then in the fall, once we have a draft of our actual strategic planning document, we'll be having some town, town halls to really continue to gather that feedback on that draft plan. So lots of opportunities still to get involved. Wonderful, and I know that there's a lot of information out there about the strategic planning process. So Jim, where can people go to learn more about this process? Please go to our website. <laughs> we have got, we are striving for complete transparency, so all sorts of information, data, and most importantly, you can actually see the the minutes of the strategic planning committee meetings. You can see the minutes of we're going to have the minutes of the work groups. People will be able to track this whole process and keep on giving feedback. Uh, there's going to be all sorts of places to give more information, but also to be able to keep on track with what we're doing. Wonderful. Well, certainly a lot happening on, on this front of strategic planning for our university. This is a chance for all of us to come together to craft the future of our great campus, the future of what we offer to our students and to one another. So um, thanks to Jim and Lynette for, for being with me today. And thanks to each of you and so many people across the campus who are taking this whole process to heart. Uh, we'll see you soon in a couple weeks.